Today I will be discussing the use of geographic information system, also known as GIS, in the healthcare field. This technology is used to track data in order to map and analyze issues so providers can assess world problems statistically. GIS has been used in a variety of ways to track diseases and issues worldwide. The first researcher that started to use geomapping was Dr. John Snow. He is considered to be the father of epidemiology. He was tracking the outbreaks of cholera in London and figuring out where the clusters were that the cholera was being spread and where they were located. Cholera is a bacterial disease that causes severe vomiting and diarrhea. Cholera is transferred through contaminated water and Dr. John Snow found what water sources were contaminated in the cities and because of geomapping, he could find and shut down the contaminated water sources. Using geomapping helped to stop the spread of cholera with just a simple map to see where the contaminated water sources were at. Geomapping can help track diseases in more ways than just one. They can help us by telling us where the disease is located so we can help patients in that area. It can also help us identify the densities, as in how many people have the disease in a certain area and where the disease is at. It can also be used to map the progression of a disease over a matter of years to see how far the disease has traveled throughout the world. I have a picture that shows one of the U.S. states, Wisconsin. Um, so through the bottom of the state here, the uh, disease that is being depicted is very, very dense. So lots of cases are down here. But towards the north end of the state, there's not as many diseases. So seeing a picture like this allows a researcher to identify how it's being spread and why it is only in the south end of the state there. A study done by Caitlin Dempsey was tracking the amount of healthcare facilities that use GIS today. <clears throat> Surveys were sent out to healthcare facilities as well as different college programs like bachelor's and master's programs. Each survey had about seven questions they asked to participants. They were closed end questions, so yes or no questions. Um, and in the clinics, the survey came back saying only about 53% said they used GIS in one way or another in the clinic. In the educational aspect of it, only 7% of the programs said they used or have worked with GIS in the curriculum. Geomapping is a very useful tool to track diseases and problems in the patient populations. The more mapping, the easier it will be to track and bring diseases to a halt. The geomapping allows researchers to get ahead of the virus and find out how it's spreading quicker. The more we use this tool, the more we can combat many diseases. Overall, healthcare facilities really need to start using geomapping to help track diseases so researchers can get ahead of it and stop the diseases that are causing outbreak in our cities. Thank you.